Hello and welcome to the Mark Webster Community Stadium, home of Atherston Town FC, for this first pre-season friendly between Tamworth and Atherston Town. Tamworth will be fielding two teams today. One will be, well, this team will be for the first half, with a change in personnel nearly completely. The only difference will be Paul Green will be staying. So we're about to get underway. Verma, uh, one of the players staying from last season's campaign. He will get us underway now. Just waiting on the referee, Alan Cox's whistle. And we're off. Immediately out. To, we have got, actually, it would be worth noting, many trialers playing today. So we will not be able to give you names of every single player. It will be the odd trialist here and there. I think there's six altogether, including the two teams. Bit of miscommunication over the head of the defence. Walters, Dexter Walters, put him under pressure, goes forwards. Then pumped clear. Home to Jazz Singh, one of the new signings from ISC Telford, who was once again a trialist, tried the little cute back heel, but it was smothered away by the Addison defence. But Tamworth will have a corner, taken by another trialist, the number eight though for Tamworth. It's him. Up towards Verma, Beeson comes, it was one, an overhead kick by the number nine again, it was cleared this time, off the line this time. He's had another couple of opportunities as the number nine. For Tamworth, a few actually very spectacular back heel and overhead kick. None of them have quite come off, been smothered away by the others in defence both times. So, Tamworth trialist now will look to give Tamworth the lead. Shot is straight into the wall and then was handballed by the number nine for Tamworth. So, Addison will have a free kick. Dexter Waters looks like he's going over to take it. Probably about Tamworth's fourth, maybe fifth corner of the game. Still haven't really made one count, although we have looked dangerous from them at Tamworth. And Walters now takes it it's in towards the back post again. Verma heads it back across the town. The Trials brings it down. I think it's Regan Upton there. The Tamworth number 14 scores right at the end of this first half. And Tamworth will probably go in 1-0, one 1-0 nil, one nil up, going to half-time 1-0 up. Yes, okay, and the ref blows for half-time, we won't even begin the second half. It rem it the full half-time score, sorry, is Tamworth 1, Addiston 0. Hello ladies and gentlemen, and uh, welcome back to the second half of uh, Addiston Town versus Tamworth FC. Uh, just before the half-time whistle went, uh, Tamworth managed to get the opening goal. Uh, so it's 1-0 going into the second half. We've had near enough a complete change uh, of the team. Tristan Dunkley. Of time and space now. He plays it into the box. And number 16 for Tamworth, Chandler Pegg, puts that straight into the back of the net after Dunkley spreads it across the goal and uh, Chandler Pegg makes it 2-0 to Tamworth and Alistair have possession on the edge of the box number 10 plays the shot and Mitch Thompson makes it 2-1 just scoring past Aidan Joins he was fairly easy um, for Thompson about the in about the 90th minute of this game, it is uh, Tamworth two, Atherston one. Dunkley to get play back underway for Tamworth then. And uh, that is full time here at the Mark Webster Community Stadium. Uh, the full time score is Tamworth 2, Atherston Town 1. Tamworth's next game is on Tuesday night at home to Solihull Moors. If you can't make the game, which is uh, I believe 7.45 kickoff, there will be live commentary from around half past seven uh, for 
on the Mixler app. Uh, you can join Kevin Stew if not. There'll be highlights of that game towards the end of next week.